What's going on, ballers? Thanks so much for tuning in again, and welcome back to another Big J Basketball box break video. I am super pumped for this one today. This is the final round, the championship match of the YouTube content creator March Madness Box Battle Tournament. So far in round one, we beat very good cards. In round two, we beat Shy City Pulls, and in round three, we beat Hitman Rips with the select H2 box that we opened last week. Best two cards from that box were this Jovic rookie, number to 25, and also number to 25, it's KG tie-dye auto to 25. So those are good enough to give us the win versus Hitman to get us into the finals. Now we are going up against Run Good Life, huge channel, over 50,000 subscribers. So this is a little bit of a, uh, David and Goliath we got going here, but RGL, he's an awesome dude. He's got an awesome channel. Definitely one of the most knowledgeable YouTubers out there when it comes to cards. Uh, but I had to get in this tournament to be nice. I got in it to win it. So we are going to go for the win today. And what are we ripping this time? 2022-23 Photogenic. This was my, one of my favorite products to rip in 2021. I got a bunch of boxes really cheap. I haven't ripped any of these for 2022 because I thought they were too expensive when they came out. And guess what? They're even more expensive now. So I spent a lot on this. The rules for this championship round, there is no price limit. Um, that's The rules have no price limit. I myself still have a price limit. I'm just a regular guy with a regular job. I, I don't work in cards or anything like that. Um, just do this for a hobby. This is something I kind of do just for fun but I wanted to go all out for the championship, so I picked up this photogenic box. These are selling for around $500 right now, so I know it's gonna be tough to get that much money back from one of these, but I just really wanted to rip one of these. I thought it'd be a cool and fun product to rip for the championship round, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Um, and what are the pros of these boxes? So all the rookie cards are serial numbered to 999 uh, or less. There's also parallels of the rookie cards um, that we can get there's one guaranteed auto. Um, and even though I didn't rip any of these, I have bought a bunch of the singles. So I'm a Mana Ginobili collector. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel, uh, again, please uh, consider subscribing. It would help me out a lot. If you're coming here from Run Good Life's channel, I'm assuming you probably already know who he is uh, at this point. But if you have not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe there. I don't know what he's ripping, but we're going to link his uh, video down below as well for this championship. So you have to comment on both videos to let us know who you think won this battle, but in terms of what I've already bought um, from Photogenic, the parallel, I kind of put the poor man's rainbow together for Ginobili. This is the silver to 99, so this is what these cards are gonna look like. Cracked ice to 75, or I guess it's called the diamond. Uh, this is the maze parallel to 25, and this is the gold out of 10. I didn't find the one of one. Um, the one of ones do have like a Donruss laser pattern, um, or a sun, uh, revolution sunburst. Um, so, all right, let's see. Ultra rare dual autographs. If we hit a dual autograph, I think that'll probably give us the win. Um, but if anybody wants to pause the back here, here's everything you can pull out of here. So there's not a ton of different parallels um, and they're pretty much all numbered. So the silver is like we already showed, silver to 99, diamond to 75, maze to 25, gold to 10, platinum one of one. The inserts also have uh, parallels as well. They don't have a silver to 99, but there's a diamond, maze, gold, and platinum. Even some of the base inserts and base cards that aren't numbered are still worth a decent amount depending on who you can get. I know like the base LeBron card has the uh, photo of him holding up the, the piece of paper with the total number of points that he had on it when he broke Kareem's uh, all-time scoring record. So I think even like a base card of that sells for like uh, $20 plus or something like that. So we're doing best box wins. We got our 10 packs here, five cards per pack. Every pack should have some sort of insert or parallel. All right, after that big long intro, <laughs> let's go ahead and get right into it. Pack number one, our first five cards. There's also the ultra rare shoe game insert, which is less than even one per case. So not back in, banking on getting one of those, but if we hit a shoe game, that would be unreal. All right, pack number one. All right, so this is my first time seeing most of these cards. So here we got Luca on the base card. So again, probably even the Luca base is not, not a terrible card. All right, more base. We got Devin Vassell, CJ McCollum, and one more base. Got DeMar DeRozan, very cool. And this should be insert or parallel number one. 
Let's see who we got here. That is going to be Johnny Davis. So we got a Johnny Davis photogenic rookie focus, just the base. All right. Pack one is definitely not going to do it in terms of getting us to win. So hopefully we get some more number cards as we make our way through the box. Base rookie insert from a guy like Johnny Davis. Definitely not going to do it. All right. Nikola Jokic on the base. Halliburton. Again, just awesome photos on all these cards. It's really fun product to rip. Just looking through at all the photos they put on here. Ray Allen. And... Ayo Desunmu. I actually, I think I remember watching this game. This is when I think he had like a uh, a rebound for a putback to win a game. I, I'm pretty sure that that's when, when that photo is from. That was an awesome game. All right. Ooh, this is backwards. This might be our auto already. Or maybe it's a parallel. Uh, the parallel is backwards. 115. Jordan Clarkson. Is this just a parallel? Let's see. Yep. Okay. So we got Jordan Clarkson on the diamond to 75. Okay, so numbered card, but I don't think a Clarkson to 75 is going to do it. That's one big change they made from uh, 2021 to 2022 is they expanded this set a lot. So there was only 100 base cards and then I think 40 rookies in uh, last year. They definitely expanded the base set, so it's probably going to be tougher to hit a numbered card of a really good player than it was in previous years. Spencer Dinwiddie. Cam Johnson. And I don't understand the way they print these cards. Okay, so the back is upside down, but his name is written right side up here. So if we put this like this, the way the back shows, now on the front, his name is upside down. But I always get confused <laughs> with horizontal cards. Panini can't figure out which way to make them. All right, Paul Pierce. And we got Hakeem Olajuwon. Let's see who we got on this one. Insert maybe. Ooh, rookie. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> Our first numbered rookie is Ryan Rollins to 999. All right. Ryan Rollins rookie, again, is not going to do it. So we got two numbered cards in the first two packs, but nothing really huge. Definitely need to pick it up as we go along here. So three packs down, seven to go. All right. Aaron Gordon. Dylan Brooks with the Memphis jersey. Didn't last too long on that team. Gary Payton. Herb Jones. And let's see what we got here. Is this another insert? Oh, this is backwards. So this might be uh, SSHGR. So this might be our signature already. Who's HGR? Solarize signatures. Ooh, Jalen Green. Unfortunately, not a rookie. This is after his rookie year. Hey. Jalen Green Auto to 75, and that is a pretty nice looking card. So not a rookie auto, but again, a lot, with a lot of the rookies in this product, I'll take a Jalen Green uh, second year to 75, especially with the way he, he finished the season this year. So, okay. Jalen Green Auto to 75, so not a gr huge auto, but not a terrible auto. And we still got six packs to go, so definitely a chance. We're going to get one more rookie to 99. Maybe an, a rookie parallel of some sort would be nice or another better player parallel than uh, who was the one we got back there. Yeah. Jordan Clarkson to 75. That's not going to do it. Quickly, Franz Wagner, T-Mac. Awesome photo of McGrady there. And we got Macal Bridges. And let's see who this is. Is this backwards? Nope. Insert, I think. Photogenic... That is going to be Luka Doncic. Unforgettable. Okay, so Luka inserts are always nice, especially from our product like Photogenic. Very cool. I'll throw the Luka in the hit stack. All right. Halfway done with the box. Five more packs to go. All right. Grimes. Stockton. Come on, I would love to get the LeBron base. It'd be pretty cool. Harrison Barnes. Shea Gildas Alexander. And oh, another backwards cards. This is probably numbered. Number seven. I see green. Tatum. Ooh, Tatum pregame. This might be a numbered insert. Come on, let's get a let's get a gold. 
All right, Cracked Ice is 75. Tatum pregame to 75, not too bad. Throw that in his stack. So we're definitely racking up the numbered cards here. So far, I think only that first pack with the Johnny David. Well, I think we only had two packs without a numbered card so far. All right, getting down to the wire here. Bones Highland, Sabonis, Scotty Barnes, Magic, and all right, last card here. Let's see who we got. Rookie, AJ Griffin, 333 out of 199. So unfortunately kind of struck out on the numbered rookies. Those are just the 999 though. So we haven't gotten any shorter print rookie parallels. Um, we got three packs left though. So we still got, still got a chance. It's not over yet. Harden. KPJ, not in the league anymore. Penny Hardaway. Cade Cunningham. And let's see who we got here. Another insert probably it looks like. This one is going to be Jalen Dern, Rookies in Motion. So also just a base insert, nothing numbered there. All right, two more packs to go. I uh, would really like to see something shorter print show up pretty soon. I don't think we got anything lower than, yeah, we got some 75s. We haven't gotten anything 25 or lower. So no maze to 25, no gold to 10. See if we can pull one of those out of these last two packs. OG, Tim Duncan, Pistol Pete, Bobby Portis, and another backwards card. All right, 166 is probably another vet, I think. Ooh, no, rookie. Okay, backwards rookie. What team is this? Wizards. Oh, Jordan Goodwin, no. Oh man, this is gonna be a real low number card, let's see. Okay, silver to 99, rookie, Jordan Goodwin. So just a base rookie parallel to 99. Oh man, we've really struck out on the rookies. Last pack. I don't know, I think that Jalen Green Auto to 75 is our best card and I don't know, behind that, the Tatum to 75 maybe. Not looking good, not looking good so far. But again, I don't know how, uh, how RGL is doing. So I don't know what he ripped, don't know, not gonna know until I finish this and then post it and see his video like everyone else. John Collins, Giannis, and very last card, uh, doesn't look like it's even serial numbered. Oh, it's a rookie though. Ooh, rookie for the Thunder. Can we get Chet, can we get Chet? <laughs> Jay Will, Jay Will. So we did get three Rookies to 9.99, but man, they were rough. Okay, let's do a quick hit recap. So I don't know, I, RGL is probably gonna have to really get skunked to uh, to lose this battle, but you never know. Let's go ahead and take a look at all of our hits here. Try and pull the rookies together, numbered stuff together. Okay, so we got a Luca insert. Nothing really huge there, not numbered. We got four rookies. We got three to three ninety nine, or three to nine ninety nine, and then we got one to ninety nine. So our three to nine ninety nine were AJ Griffin, Ryan Rollins, and Jalen Williams, and not the Jalen Williams we want. We got Jay Will, not Jay Dub. Got one more rookie parallel: Jordan Goodwin, silver to ninety nine. Got a Tatum pregame to seventy five. We got a Jordan Clarkson diamond also to seventy five, and then our auto was Jalen Green, second year auto. Sticker auto to 75. I don't know if that's going to do it. Run Good Life might uh, might very well be running away with this one, but you never know. Hopefully he got a skunk of a box, and, and uh, if he gets dusted, we might get the win. But otherwise, that's all we got for here today. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you all on the next video.